Hello, it's me, Tarina, and today I'm gonna tell you the story of the best party night I had in Japan. It was the best. I was in Japan with my classmates and friends, and among my friends I have the reputation of being the Tinder guru and Tinder assistant and anyway, the Tinder master. So we decided to have a little party, so I Tinder mastered ourselves some company. I got there four guys, okay, just two of them were my Tinder matches, the two two other guys were friends of one of the Tinder matches, so I didn't get everyone from Tinder. Well, I kinda did. <laughs> we invited them to my room on the condition that they would bring us sake and maybe some juices and so they did and the thing that we did was we had um like big big water bottles and we cut them open to have them like as cans we would just mix some sake and some juice and had an amazing drink it was the greatest idea ever we were having a blast and it was time to cut another can for us i didn't have any scissors so the way that we would cut them was was with a knife and because I was the host of course I was gonna do that I was there cutting and one of our guests yells at me Darina be careful you're drunk and of course I'm like no I'm not drunk and I might have cut myself Darina you okay yeah did you cut yourself yeah! And I don't know if I have a scar there anymore. Okay, so can you see that little line there? I have a scar there. I had a forever memory. So every time I cut myself, I get a bit dizzy because I just, my body doesn't like losing blood, even though it might be just a little bit. I, I did, it did bleed. It was like I just got it diagonally. <laughs> So we just got little band-aids and put it all over my tiny little finger and and because I was dizzy I had to have my legs up. So I was basically parting like this. No. Like this. Just so I could get the dizziness out of my head. Again people were like, Darina, are you okay? Yeah! Are you sure? Yeah. There was the moment when me and my friends were like, do we have to go to like a Japanese hospital? Like, I don't wanna, but I just got over it and we decided to continue our night and go to my favorite karaoke place. It was like this little, little karaoke place that all was owned by an Australian guy. And I went there so many times when I were, was in Japan. I loved it. They had all karaoke songs possible, like all, they had the Disney songs and the pop versions of Disney songs. And by the time that we got there, I was pretty drunk, so the first thing I did, having four guys with us, look for a new guy. So we opened the door and I see this cute little guy. I go straight to him, I find out that he's British and I decide that he's my new boyfriend. We go outside just to chat and my friends start to get worried like where, where is Tarina? Uh, where did she go? And then they look down from the window and they see me throwing up on the street with the British guy holding my hair. How to seduce a man? I know. I know. Then my friends come down with my purse and I take my purse and I'm like, thanks guys, I'm gonna go sleep with him. I'm gonna go sleep with his place. I'm gonna go sleep at his place. And my friends were like, okay, like you're, you're Tarina, like no one can stop you. And I'm like, thanks. And then I go and leave my friends with the four American guys that I got them and yeah, so that was my story of <laughs> a night of everything. Tell me in the comments section what is some of the craziest nights that you you've had. I've had many crazy nights. This was just one of them. 
I'm Tavina. Thank you for watching and see you later. Bye.